Hey guys. <laughs> so I brought Piggy to the little forest and I saw him stop and like look and then I noticed there were some apples on the ground. Come! He hasn't seen the apples in like a year. Well, probably about seven or eight months. And this is a completely different spot to the last spot where he found the apples. So he's such a clever little thing. He's checking out all the apples on the ground. I wonder why he's not... Oh, there, he picked one up. Come show Mama. What did you get? Can I see, Baba? Let me see. Wait. <gasps> Look, it's legitimately a little apple. Did you find yourself a little apple? Wow. But Piggy, pick them into um, see about truffles, not apples, my boy. Peach is better. Well, he does have half, I think. Oh my boy, he's so clever. <laughs> that was interesting because I, you know, usually I run to take him away from him. And I've started this new thing with him where I just kind of let him do what he wants to do. Obviously not dangerous. But just to like observe, like observe, sorry, what he's going to do with it. And like there, he just bit the apple in half and then left it. So he didn't eat it, which is great because I didn't want him to eat it. But he had a little bit of independence to decide. Should we go this way? Come. Let's go this way, shall we? We might find more apples if we go this way, my boy. So it's just me and Piggy today. Henry's working. Oh, there's apples everywhere. This is the spot where he found the apples the last time. <sighs> You guys, I'm going to miss this little park, which we've nicknamed Lincoln Park. Obviously, it's not called Lincoln Park, but I'm going to miss this because this is like a little caged in enrichment area. It's um, completely secure. Obviously, other dogs can come in, so I always have to be very cautious. What are you doing? But I can let him just do his thing. He can sniff around and explore and... There he goes with another apple. He's not actually picking them up. Maybe they're not ripe enough yet. Oh my goodness. But he's loving it. See, he like... Okay, he picked that one up. Is he going to hide from his mom? What are you doing, Piggy? See, he just bit it and now he's left it. Why? Are they not sweet enough yet, Piggy? Or do you think they're balls? <laughs> Could you find us some truffles while you're in there, Piggy? Huh? Find us some truffles, my boy. Again, bit it, spat it out. You're ruining the apples for all the other dogs, my boy. <laughs> It's so fun to just watch and explore. Oh my goodness. I'm glad your dad can't see how dirty you're potentially getting this stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna show you guys like literally what he's doing. See, he's just biting it in half and then dropping it. Have you not found the perfect apple yet, my baba? I always get so happy when he is like doing something independent like this. Because if you've been watching our channel for a while, you'll know that when we first got Lincoln, he was very um, insecure and like very scared to be on his own. And he still does suffer a little bit with separation anxiety. But his confidence has just grown. Hey! But when we first got him, there's no way he would have gone that far away from me. And I mean, even if you watch him while he's doing this, he's not looking to see where I am all the time. He does keep making a little bit of eye contact with me. Oh, he's not dropping that one. 
Cool. Um, you know, but he's just happy to do his own thing. How am I going to get him back out of there? So it's not like I can call him. Lincoln. Oh gosh. And I'm just walking through spider web after spider web. <laughs> um, hello, Mr. Independent. He's not even looking to see if I'm still here. I don't actually want him eating these and he's eating away. Oh. Come, come piggy. Oh gosh. Thinking, come here baby. Okay, I'm gonna grab him because I'm concerned about these apples. Okay, so we are now done with the apples. <laughs> Look at all the stuff on his little body. No, 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 no. Seeing spots in the room. No more apples. No more apples, my baby. Come. Let's just walk. I'm pretty sure they're probably completely fine. Oh. But you just never know, do you? So you just want to be a little bit careful. So. How pretty these are. I wonder what they are. Does anybody know? Very pretty. One more likes to explore through the woods too, Pinko. Oh, I can see the cows. I don't think you guys will be able to see them there in the distance to the fence. Oh, it's so pretty in here. It's so like overgrown. I have done many workouts in here and like run <laughs> circles in here especially when it's really hot because there's so much um tree cover it's always really cool in here and so i've come in here a few times and just run around in circles <laughs> through the trees which is awesome it's so much fun obviously i wish it was bigger but yeah we're gonna miss this place aren't we piggy Puff? let's go back this way come let's go this way We'll just have to find some more little forests for us to go walking in. Hey, Piggy. This one's just so convenient because it's right by our house. And as I said, like, it's completely enclosed and it's quite small. So you can pretty much see through the whole thing, you know, wherever you are. And so I can watch out for dogs while Lincoln does his little thing. Come, we're going to go this way. No, we're not going after apples. Come. He's like, Mom, the apples are not that way. Come. Come, let's go. Alright guys, thanks for joining us on our little walk today. We hope you had fun and um, Piggy's advice for the day is don't eat your apples. <laughs> and I hope if you do eat an apple, you think of this little foraging snuffle pig finding his. So have a great day everyone. Thanks for joining us. Bye. Thanks so much for watching everyone. We hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give us a thumbs up, leave us a comment below. If you're new around here, please hit subscribe. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.